Key concepts of campaign management. The campaigns tab is where you'll likely spend the most time in your AdWords account. From here you can receive alerts. You may see an alert box tinted yellow, green, or red. These alerts provide important information about your account and about new AdWords features such as declined payment. Create a new campaign. Click the new campaign button above the table to create a new campaign. Change campaign status and settings. Pause, resume, or delete campaigns, or edit campaign settings by checking the box to the left of one or more campaigns and then selecting one of the buttons above the table. Review the list of campaigns. This display this table displays summary uh, this table displays summary data about all online campaigns in your account. Use the date range drop down menus above the table to select the day or date range you'd like to review. You can also view all campaigns, all active campaigns, or all but deleted campaigns by clicking the appropriate link above the table. You can also refine your view of campaigns by choosing to view only enabled or only paused and enabled campaigns by using the controls above the table. Below are descriptions of each table column. Campaign, a list of your campaigns. Click the name of any campaign to see the ad groups within that campaign and any other relevant statistics. Budget, the current daily budget of each campaign. Status, the status of each campaign. A campaign status can be enabled, paused, deleted, pending, or ended. Enabled, set to run normally, paused, temporarily suspended, and not currently running. Deleted, deleted and no longer running, pending, not yet started running, ended, no longer running, and as ended as already paused. Your campaign might also be limited by budget. View budget recommendations if applicable for campaigns that are missing impressions due to meeting their budget regularly. Clicks. The clicks accrued for the ads in each campaign. Impressions. The number of times the campaign's ads have been displayed or Google or on Google or on sites in the Google network. CTR, which is click-through rate. The number of clicks divided by the number of impressions that the ads have received. This is expressed as a percentage. Two clicks for 100 page views equals a 2% click-through rate. Average CPC, the average cost accrued for clicks on the ads within that campaign. Cost, the total cost that a campaign has accrued during the time frame you selected. Average position, this refers to the average position on a search result page that an ad appears in when it's triggered by that keyword. Conversion rate, one per click. How many user clicks turned into actual conversions for the advertiser? Conversion rate equals the number of conversions divided by the number of ad clicks. This applies only to users who have set up conversion tracking. Uh, cost divided by conversion, or one per click. Uh, it's the total cost divided by the total number of conversions. Uh, this tells you how much each conversion costs. This applies only to users who have set up conversion tracking. In conversion rate, one per click, number of conversions divided by total clicks. This tells you your conversion rate. This applies only to users who have set up conversion tracking. And the above table columns are shown by default. Uh, you can use column customization to add or remove metrics as you like. Here are the key features on the Campaigns tab. Account tree. Use this menu besides your account pages to switch between the campaigns and ad groups. Performance summary graphs. Use, this custom graph. uh, use these custom graphs to compare trends on every level of your account. Click the Change Graph Options link to see data points like clicks, impressions, and average position or to compare two of these metrics at once. Networks tab. This is where you manage your placements. You'll also see the summary statistics for both your search and display networks. And campaign rollups. Rollup views let you see and edit all of a campaign's keywords, placements, or ads in one place instead of finding and changing them ad group by ad group. You'll find rollup views on the keywords tab and networks tab of your account. Dynamic help content. Help sections display the FAQs you most likely need for the page you're viewing. Of course, you can also always click the help link in the top corner of your account to see the full out where it's help center. Here are some actions you can take on your campaigns tab. Campaign and ad group creation workflow. Create new campaigns and ad groups with the new plus button at the top of any table. Inline editing. Edit ads, keywords, placements, and bids within the tables on the campaign and ad group tabs in your account. Just hover over a row to reveal the editable fields. Copy move. A click of this button lets you copy and move keywords, placements, and ad groups between campaigns without leaving the campaign management interface.